Hello, this is Nick from Pressman Auto doing a video walkthrough of our 2023 Ram 1500. So what I'm going to do is we're going to walk all the way around, check for any dents, scratches, any kind of blemishes on the outside. Then we're going to go inside, go over some of the features, make sure everything's working properly. And finally, we'll pop the hood so we can evaluate just a little in the engine bay j just for fun. So first impressions are extremely good. <laughs> it, it looks like it needs a bath. But other than that, I'm not seeing any dents or any scratches up here which isn't a huge surprise since this is a 2023, but nonetheless, good to know. But let's start going around to see if there is anything that we can find. Tires on here are in great condition, so that's wonderful. So if I do see anything, I'll be sure to stop, zoom in, make sure you get a good visual. Speaking of, oh, never mind. It was just dirt. I thought I found something, but twas not so. Cool. So just use the key fob to pop it. Um, this one has the bed liner in here as well, which is actually really nice bed liner. So that's pretty sweet. All right, well, dare I say a clean 10 out of 10 for the exterior. Um, yeah, I didn't see a single thing. It looks awesome. So let's hop inside. Oh, nice, you got your running boards. All right, so we're gonna turn it on, but when we do, I'm gonna leave the camera up here on the dash. That way, if you got any kind of warning lights popping up, you'll be the first to know. So let's check it out. Alrighty, so it looks like we got one warning light up right now, which is my seatbelt light, which is correct. I'm not wearing my seatbelt. Other than that, everything up here looks super, super solid. Let's cycle through a couple things real quick, just for fun. Awesome. Well, that looks great. As far as the interior goes, you have a butt ton of features in here. So <laughs> for the sake of time, I'm gonna go a little bit fast just so we're not here all day. Um, but yeah, so up here you're gonna have your cruise control. I believe this one has adaptive cruise control, if I'm not mistaken. Um, just a couple other basic controls over here. You're gonna have your auto stop start feature as well as your four wheel drive. You can toggle that a bunch of ways. Your AC is working great and it does blow cold. Everyone always asks that, is it blowing cold? <laughs> yes, it's blowing cold. <laughs> up here you're gonna have your heated steering wheel, your heated seats and your cooled seats, which are really cool home i mean to be totally honest you're kind of decked out you have pretty much every feature that the car can have so here's gonna be your ac you got your media your navigation you can connect your phone and whatever else and you got your vehicle stuff up here mirror dimmers power side step on and on and on and then you're just basic settings so you got a butt ton of stuff to play with down here you got your towing your parking sensor and on and on and on so you're gonna have a couple plugins down here. And here you got a bunch of extra space. And yeah, so over there, pretty basic stuff. So let's make sure your windows roll down, windows roll up, windows roll down and up. Cool, up top here. Honestly, it's really freaking nice. So as far as interior condition goes, it is, to be honest, kind of immaculate. It looks really freaking good. I'm not seeing any dents, any scratches, any tears, any, any anything. So that's wonderful. So let's pop the hood. We'll check out a little bit of the engine bay and then that should be good for our video. dropping stuff all over the place there we go okay 
All right, I don't know how mechanically inclined you are or aren't, but I always like to at least show under the hood, um, just because even if you don't know anything about cars, you do know what neglect looks like. So if there's like acid buildup around the battery, all the metal pieces are brown and covered in rust, then you know, it's not the best. But this uh, that's obviously not the case with this one. This is in great condition. Um, there's really not even dust on it. So good, good stuff there. If you are mechanically inclined, we can go into a little bit more detail, but we'll keep this video pretty user friendly for now. Suffice to say, when you pop the hood of an engine bay, this is exactly what you want to see. So if you have any other questions or there's anything else you would like to see, just let me know. I'm happy to show you anything on here. But for now, this is your new truck.